Good morning ladies and gentlemen, I'm Easy69 and welcome back to the channel. Now today we are at the last episode of the lowest DPM tank in the game. So it is the VK7201 but for this video I'm not going to talk really much about the tank itself. So what I'm going to do is, I'll, I'll, it's been hard to do this and I, I've, mean to, I've been meaning to do it for such a long time but as you know and if you've stuck to this series um, you're going to know that I wanted to make because I've gone on holiday with the family for two weeks I wanted a video to drop every single day so I didn't want to drop 14 tank review videos or tanks that are coming into store because because I'm away, if Wargaming cancelled the sales, uh, I'm not going to know. And that means there's a video out there that is not true. So I wanted something easy to, for, to drop while I'm away and easy to make the content. And that is the DPM. So for two whole weeks, you've had nothing but DPM. So what I'm really going to talk about in this video is you guys and myself, my family, etc. So those of you that are here today most likely have been keeping up with the series of this DPM for the last two weeks. So this series, obviously, I've wanted to make it easy to, to drop because me and my family are on a vacation. Uh, we are, we was in Cuba. I mean, by the time this video drops, we are heading home. We will be heading home for a lovely 10 to 11 hour plane journey back to the UK. Um, but what I really want to say is thank you to you guys because without you guys, me and my family would not have had this holiday. We would have no never been able to afford to go to Cuba. I mean, this holiday has cost me around six thousand uh, pound. It's it's a lot of money. It's a lot of money. But the reason that we wanted to go away is because. Uh, We've had a, a tough few years. Now, a few of you that have kept up with the channel will probably know this because I have uh, announced it in my community tab. Uh, but the main reason that we wanted to go away is because because of the last two years, we, we've, as a family, we've had probably the worst two years of our, well, not probably, but the worst two years of our life. And it can't get much worse than the, year, the years that we've had. So, this is what I want to just talk to you guys about and let you in on my family pretty much. I mean, I know I don't have to, but you you guys are part of me now. You, you're a big part of my life. I mean, watching my videos, earning this revenue from YouTube and being able to take my family away on vacations, being able to treat my family every single month when I get my YouTube money through. Um, so it's a big part of my life. So that's why I wanted to just let you guys in on that part of my life. So. A couple of years ago now, my daughter, uh, she was sexually, sexually uh, abused by a really good friend of ours, actually, a really good family friend. And she was only 10 years old at the time of this happened. So when my daughter finally found the courage, when she got, it was about a year later, so it happened for around about a year. Um, my daughter at school, she learned sex education. So the week that she learned sex, ed sex education, it was, she learned about inappropriate touching. So because of this, what she learned at school, uh, it gave her the, I mean, to tell us, I mean, it's, she gave us the, it gave her the courage to tell us what had been happening. So obviously because of that, we phoned the police, the guy got arrested and we was taking this guy to court. So everything was going to plan. We had really good, really good evidence. We had a really strong uh, team behind us and we was due to go to cr uh, a Crown Court uh, on April the 1st. So we were supposed to be at court uh, to, for our trial to, to begin at around about 10, 10, 10 a.m. in the morning. Uh, but what happened was it, it never actually went to court. So the guy that did this to our family, he had, he's barrister, he's solicitor or, or whatever you, you want to call it, he's lawyer. His lawyer has 
pretty much been begging him all along to to plead guilty because there was just too much too much evidence uh, against him uh, that all along he was nope I'm not going guilty um, I'm going not guilty so the day of the court where we were supposed to be at court by 10 a.m. Uh, that morning that very morning we was me and my family was getting ready I mean we took my daughter to school because we just wanted to she didn't need to be there until a bit later on in the afternoon so we just wanted it to be as normal as possible so we took her to school and we had a knock at the door from about nine o'clock in the morning or just gone nine o'clock we had a knock at the door and it was the police it was the detectives and they informed us that uh, the guy that did this to my daughter he had committed suicide that very morning so we were supposed to be at court by 10 a.m his body was found at 8 a.m so it never went to court because he actually killed himself he couldn't cope with what he had done i mean he left a letter to his wife apologizing for everything he'd done everything he had put her through uh, and so on so because of all this that went on and because everything that went on we promised my daughter that when everything was was finished we would we was going to take her away on on a holiday that uh, just to clear her mind have a little bit of fun and just forget about everything and we even uh, let her choose where we went so she chose Cuba she chose Cuba we'd been there before and she absolutely loved it so we said fine we'll go but the thing with Cuba it is so expensive it, it cost us around six thousand uh, pound to go to Cuba and that's where you guys come in I mean without you guys watching my videos without my patreon supporting me for everything I do there is no way that we would ever be able to afford to, to take her to Cuba um, we would have just gone somewhere sunny or somewhere in the UK in a caravan somewhere cheap uh, But because of you guys watching my videos and seeing the channel grow so quickly uh, We we managed to raise all that money from from the videos So it has really really helped us out as a family to take my family away to, I mean, it's the beginning of the end. It was a closure of, of what happened so because of you guys, I mean, we've been through such a lot. We haven't just been through what happened to my daughter. After this guy uh, had taken his own life, we as a family, I mean, my daughter at the age of 12 was getting death threats from 40 and 50 year old adults. So we had no choice but to be moved. The police moved us. The police put us on police protection. They moved us away from my area. And that's why we... You can see that I've moved house, etc., etc., and that is the whole reason why we had to move house. So we've moved house now. It's all finished. We've forgot about everything. We've took the family away uh, just for that closure. And I know I've rabbit on, but I really do want to thank you guys. You guys have been so supportive. A lot of you have been so supportive of what had happened and towards my channel. Uh, and I do really want to thank you guys. And that I know I've took this video to oh, that was supposed to be reviewing the VK, which is the lowest DPM in tier 10, by the way. Uh, just wanted to get that in before the video ends. But as I said, I really do want to thank you guys. I appreciate every single one of you that watches my videos. And forever make it make it continue for however long I will continue. Who knows? But I hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Just a little insight of my life, pretty much. And I will see you soon. Bye-bye.